The painted bird is a rare species among South Florida's continental restaurants. Walking in, the diner is immediately struck by the simple yet cozy intimacy of the place. It's not large, but the owners have done a remarkable job with what space they do have. Large mirrors framed in latticework create the illusion of a much larger room, but the restaurant only seats 45. Opening the menu, you'll be tempted by such appetizers as snails on a bed of fresh spinach with garlic butter and hollandaise sauce, or the feta cheese and spinach fritters with fresh walnuts. I skipped the appetizer and soup of the day, heading straight for the Caesar salad. The portion was big enough for two, but had a certain mustard taste that seemed a little overpowering to me. The duck is supposed to be the bird's claim to fame, and after tasting it, I can see why. The duckling was tender and moist, covered with an apple sauce. It was topped with cashew nuts and complemented with fresh vegetables done to perfection for $9.95. If fowl isn't your fancy, try the veal. It's veal filet accompanied by shrimp and chicken covered with a creamy vegetable sauce coming in at $10.95. The meal comes with hot bread, impossible to eat without making a mess, and a house salad that I wish I'd had instead of the Caesar. Now, if you still have room for it, the Painted Bird features all homemade desserts like chocolate mousse pie, black forest cake, or key lime pie. The entire meal for two came to around $40 with tip. That's without wine. The Painted Bird is open seven days a week, serving lunch and dinner. Beer and wine only, and all major credit cards are accepted. Don't forget to make reservations, though. This Coral Gables find has been found people flock here on the weekends. I'm the Mystery Diner, Channel 4 News.